Yeah. Hi everyone guys. Uh, this is Dr. Sreekan uh, from the Team MDS Conquer. Uh, today we'll be having our first smart video. Uh, probably I'll be covering uh, different types of carcinomas that are associated with thyroid gland. I'll be covering all the MCQs uh, related to this uh, types of carcinomas of thyroid. Okay. In, in a very smart way. Okay, coming to the types, you know that this is papillary, follicular, medullary, and anaplastic. And this order is the order of instance. Means they can ask you a question like which of the, which of the following carcinoma of thyroid is most common? That is papillary, followed by follicular, followed by medullary, and followed by anaplastic. And the most common area where we get confused is the types of histological types of amyloblastoma. The most common histological type of amyloblastoma is follicular, whereas the most common histological type of carcinoma of thyroid is papillary. The order is papillary, follicular, medullary, and anaplastic. The second part of the table will be focusing on the mode of spread. Okay, papillary will have element, it spreads by lymph. Follicular will have O-N, it spreads by blood. And medullary is by both lymph and blood. Anaplastic is by direct invasion. And third one is the most common site to which it spreads. I mean, the most common uh, site where it metastasizes. Papillary is for lungs. Follicular is for bone, medullary is for the liver, and anaplastic is for lung cell. Means both anaplastic as well as medullary they spread to lungs. And the fourth column is about the treatment. Papillary is by near total thyroidectomy, follicular is by near total thyroidectomy again, medullary is by total thyroidectomy, whereas anaplastic is simple, it is a symptomatic treatment. Apart from this, there are many other questions and most commonly asked questions related to the papillary. Okay, as already said, papillary is the most common thyroid carcinoma. Second one, it has good prognosis, that is PP, it has good prognosis, NH, and uh, it has some of the bodies in it, that is again PP, so papillary, most common, papillary P, that is prognosis is good, papillary P, some of the bodies are seen. And apart from this, you can see this orphan eye nucleus. Okay, orphan eye eye nucleus is most commonly seen in the case of a papillary carcinoma of thyroid. And apart from this, you can make a note about the cyst. Okay, thyroid of the cyst most commonly leads to papillary carcinoma again. The patient is undergoing radiotherapy to thyroid gland or neck. The most common carcinoma that can occur is papillary again. So these are the most commonly asked questions related to the papillary. So coming to the follicular. As I said, like follicular FF. So FNAC is contraindicated in the case of your follicular carcinoma of thyroid. And coming to the medullary, medullary is related to the calcitonin metabolism. So I feel like these are the most commonly asked questions, and I, I hope that this video is helpful for you guys.